join the Patreon for exclusive shows as well as if you want me to react to a specific video, you can do so by commenting on my weekly thread. Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to our first actual catching up series where we do multiple groups. This is going to be an algorithm mess because you guys won't know what you'll search for. Yeah, you think it'll pop up like this video will pop up if you search one of the groups here? If it is, I should be doing this more because that's a pretty cool hack. I could be throw away. Easy. Uh, easy. I, I didn't know this entire song by heart because I spammed this on Spotify. It is such a good song, actually. Probably one of their best releases alongside Anti Fragile. You guys said I had to react to the choreo. You're, actual, you're absolutely right. I saw the choreo on the core. Dude, they are hopping everywhere. They are so hip and cool. I need to see the entire thing. So we have the garage and then we got Ives. Uh, hey, ya. Yeah. Hey, ya. Yeah. We heard this chorus. My thoughts on this? Eh, the chorus was very boring. It was, it was just, yeah, that was my first impression. That chorus is a bit underwhelming. Yeah, and then uh, we're gonna have Baby Monster Better Up 7 version. First time I'm actually watching it, I listened to the audio. Ayan was the build up, huh? And I did get sort of uh, whiplashed from hearing her, but either way, let's get to it. Ooh, that's loud. Making it look easy. God. That woodwind instrument. Hey. 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 I don't need to do the dance practice, huh? It's right here. Let's go. Oh, they don't show it. Your hands. What? Clap your hands, fill the now, I got the man, clap your hands now. What the fuck? Clap your hands now. I push him down, then you're sure in your mind. They do it again, right? Drink, drink. Yeah. <laughs> wow. That's just, oh my god. That's so cool, hip, and sexy at the same exact time. The choreographers worked extra hard for this one. Oh my god. You don't need that many pearls, bro. I've been trying so long to show you, show you, show you. Oh. All right, let's go. Let's see the chorus. Is that backup dancer? It's Sakura. Oh. Boom. Oh my god, the nose pier. Oh my, she's cosplay the fucking Naruto six pads of pain. Oh my god, those are fucking hot. Cool. <laughs> Oh my <laughs> Oh my god dude I was missing out I was you can't just you can't just be listening to the song man Oh my god God, okay. Ooh. 
such a simply and effective move, man. Oh my, oh my god, going double time on that one. <laughs> my short burst of energy. And then a fast. Uh, yeah, 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 it's just old Apple, dude. I can't speak because I'm not a choreographer. Oh, bro. It wasn't just a, I, I think with the song though, I think this was a very, very risky, very risky release of a title because it's just a very smooth R&B. It's not what you think of a conventional K-pop with the break, a build up, the chorus and another, the bridge, you know, it's just very smooth. And then I think people that are addicted to that genre will get kind of bored at the yeah maybe at the three fourth mark not two third the three yeah around here that's when you get kind of bored because they're not really doing anything but the, just the, just the melody is so good what is it about it i just think it, that delayed instrumental star the way the melody is very very fast starting from that very very slow slow and dreamy and then just a very cool hip-hop genre i think that contrast is kind of what makes this song shine a bit it's very catchy those last two syllables are very catchy the last two syllables <laughs> ba, di, di. Yo, what was that choreo bro hey. Hey. <laughs> Okay, let's see the full dance practice. This is the choreo you learn to, to show that you could pop your pussy. I think this is the one. This is the once you start. Well, you know the studio dance videos on YouTube, right? Where you go to like classes. Once you start doing this move, everyone's gonna start shouting, right? Man. It's the perfect balance of hip, cool, sexy, sex appeal. It's got it all, actually. That's what's. And this one, let's see this one, let's see this move. Hey. It's, it's wow, it's bordering sort of goofiness. But if you do it correctly, Jesus fucking Kozlo's dude, her fucking abs, man. <laughs> mm. Mm. Yeah, let's have one shot on that one. So, okay, so here's the thing. Um, uh, I just found the New Jeans House Sweet choreo. <laughs> I said this in my uh, reaction. You guys are like, oh, I let's copy choreo New Jeans. No, it's just the, it's just the, sometimes you, sometimes you reuse moves. That was 100% New Jeans House Sweet dance choreo. Right here. Look at you one. Yeah, right there, going down. That was the New Jeans House Sweet choreo. Yeah, yeah. What, is this copying how sweet? No. Oh, they take out the this thing? Wait, did they just do it? Oh, oh it's the second part. Also, this is the perfect genre too for their voices and seeing all the su success <laughs> I think you keep going on this genre, right? You don't go those powerful, you know, just belting out like sort of songs I think this is a great genre for a little styrofoam yeah. 
this is the color that they're very they're barely good at and i think this is a very successful song no Ooh, the footwork that has gotta hurt the soles of your feet Hey, 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 hey. Yeah. Good queen, Yeonjin. Mm. Hey, hey, hey. They jump in the music video. Oh, yeah, the double time. <laughs> I, I would say this is probably the goofiest move. They, I don't think they had to go double time with that. That's just a little nitpick. That's it. Hey, yeah. Let's get it. Let's get it. Look at it. Pay attention. Oh, double to my moldy gabble guy. No labor to tell me she's done my dad. My mad you don't know when you say it's never no. They're playing the chorus in the background, huh? Yeah. No labor to tell me she's done my dad. My mad you don't know when you say it's never no. But I'm not a thing. Bro, hold on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's fun how they're utilizing Liz's just clear, bright, heavenly tone under a trap beat. They did this with I Am. Interesting what they're doing there. Instead of just giving it that very flowery instrumental. Ooh, that entry. <laughs> One young is the break queen, bro. One young is just the fucking break queen. Ah. All right, let's go to this chorus. Hey, uh, hey, uh, hey, yeah, uh, it's the sun, it's the sun. Hey, yeah, uh, hey, yeah, uh, hey, yeah. Uh. Oh, God. Was that a variation of Espa's next level? <laughs> Dude, whoa, who the hell is Carl? <laughs> that chorus dude Liz, you just you just saved that chorus she just came in clutch the fucking three-pointer tied the cl <laughs> clock at 0 0.1 seconds the buzzer beater dude that's what that was It's a, it's a very monotonous chorus, huh? You guys agree? It's just... Uh, uh. It's not even trying to sound like an earworm too. It's just... I don't know. It's just very low quality in my opinion. Let's go. Happily ever after. Okay, what the fuck? I have to keep analyzing it. Everything around this chorus is a masterpiece. Fuck 
fucking do not, dude. I have to analyze that one, bro. Uh, coming out in the shadows. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, she's on the break this time. <laughs> Just riding the carousel. <laughs> Let me stop pausing. Let me just finish the entire thing. Hey, yeah, uh, hey, yeah. Is Liz doing it again? Of course she is. Of course she is. Okay. Of course. They're really loving Lee's whole this comeback, dude. Oh my god, the queen of fucking breakdowns. What, a trap breakdown into a... What is that? Reggae Latin pop? that one close up oh. let's go I kind of want to hear somebody else do that line too. Nah, it is. Nah. Only Liz is capable. Okay. She's got it. She's got it. Oh, with that being said, One Young had this line. Where in the way did One Young sing? It was just the break. Where was she? Like, besides the chorus, I mean. Because this is, uh, this is together. Dude. Is this song really gaslighting me into liking the chorus like NCT Smoothie? Is I think it's just that effect. Lee's so really shine in this one. She just made this one so much fucking fun. After, after. Nope. And I would just have to say, in terms of like preference of vocal tone, Liz is first. And Lee's was like a very, very close. She's second, but she's a very close first. Her, her It's such a charming vocal tone. And it highlights it more in, in here. This Latin reggaeton beat. Ooh. Do they do this in their other songs? I don't think they've ever done this. Yo, yo, this is actually their first like song where it's jam-packed with a lot of uh, like changes. Usually this part, they just repeat the... Uh, what, what part of the song is this? The structure of this song is actually so high quality. The only thing they repeat is the pre-chorus and the chorus. The bite isn't the post-chorus. This song is so high quality, actually. This chorus is just, it's just so mundane that it's perfect for balancing out the rest of this masterpiece, I think. I think that's what they're going for. Yeah. I think that it's perfect, actually, in that way. <laughs> Post chorus, they just kept us in suspense by giving us nothing. This was. Right, it's just keeping us in suspense. You'd be like, what the hell? What is this post chorus? Why aren't they singing? Where is the melody? Where is the instrumental? And the fucking Lee So from Compton just shoots out at you like what the fuck? 
god, with the Itsy's wannabe Korea, dude. Oh my god. Where's mommy Eugen? You did it, you did it, you did it, you did it. Wow. Wow. Is this actually my ranking? Let's actually revise my ranking. Spice? <sighs> Dude, I'll be honest, man. Lee's husband grew on me. Her tone? I think I heard like I do her a cover or something on my break, but just such a charming tone, man. It's actually one in a million tone when you really think about it. Oh my gosh, just one of those voices. Narcissistic, my mirror, I love it. I'm gonna give this one a 7 out of 10. After like, bro, 8 out of 10. Actually, I think 9 out of 10 fits it. 10 out of 10, easy. <laughs> Interesting enough, I love off the record. 11? I think 11 has to be reevaluated. I, uh, recently I've been listening to it again, and I feel like it just, it's not the first place spot anymore. I think, actually, this is perfect. Yeah, for the perfect spot for 11. It's still a 9 out of 10 for me. Yeah, but I think that just the cool verse does drop it a bit in quality, but it's probably one of the best uh, intro verses from One Young. This might get blocked. Screwing up the entire video. Seven. They left the setter open in the music video, right? That's where Ayan is right now. All right, guys, what are your bets? Is I gonna overdance or underdance in this way? <laughs> Memes. Leave her alone, okay? Let her do what she wants. I get what she's. I get what she's doing, dude. The choreo's fucking boring. The choreo's boring. You 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 spam practice it all day. Well, just let her put some more oomph into it. You know what I mean? Let her feel herself on stage. I get what she's trying to do. What is going on? One th wow, one thing I realized, they don't have choreo, huh? They don't have, wow. More vocal focus? Oh my, oh my, oh my. She did the build up too, right? Ice Princess Chiquita? They changed it. Ion did that in the the the, the leaked recording. And she's doing the okay the first chorus instead of Rami. Better up, better up, better up. Can't okay, stop. Rook is angry. Go, 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 and the bottom is a peak. Mirror, oh, boss, baby. Remember me. The lyrics are <laughs> Remember me. I sting like a bee. All right, dude. I'll hurt you in that way, huh? But bees die when they sting somebody. And wasn't that Parita's line? There it is. It didn't feel off. That was okay. Hey. Let's go, This might get blocked, actually. We'll see.
so a lot of you treasure makers are saying like oh you got to hear alive the uh the yg dance party obviously this isn't treasure but i mean i could envision what they're the, what they're going for dude i i i fucking i hi i sorry sorry for comparing but uh, 80s man 80s I just think like a finisher, you just have to do like 80s or you just don't do it at all. It's just a very fun, lighthearted way to end it, right? Everybody can sing along. It invokes a different emotion in that way. It's a very fun emotion while 80s is more hype. But that's what I think. When you do the YG dance party, aren't you, try aren't you trying to hype up the audience? I think doing so with just that energy that 80s delivers. Uh, I, I I think it's just I'm, I'm spoiled. And overall, this song, yeah, it, it was very underwhelming as a debut. I think all the comments were like, it's very underwhelming, the song. Like, what is this Recycle Lisa money beat? At least the rap was very good. I think that's what everybody said. That's exactly what every single person said. And this is what's dangerous. This is what's dangerous. You, I don't think you ever release B-Sides first before your comeback. You release the first thing first. You release your comeback first, no matter what. Okay, good stuff.